Cindy Berkland here with cindyberkland.com and welcome back to Naked Money. And this week we have been on a series called 10 Ways to Inspire Others. And today is number six, I'm sorry, number seven, stand your ground. And this is a huge one. Um, I have a big issue with people that they'll tell you one thing and then they do another, or they waffle back and forth on something or you know you can walk right over them because they don't stand their ground. And I remember a long time ago when I was a little girl, my dad would say, stand for something or fall for anything. And that really had me, that really resonated with me with my dad because he really, you know, my dad has always been really, really, really um, he has certain principles that no matter what he's going to stand behind and there's no getting around that. And that really encouraged me, you know, walking in my father's shoes, being like him is like, I get to stand, I have take a line in the sand on certain things. And people know that about me that I'm very, um, I'm not going to change my mind on certain things that I really believe strongly in. And standing your ground is important. That's the same thing as having boundaries and boundaries are so important and we don't have them. Our kids can walk all over us. Our family can walk all over us. It's not good to not have boundaries in business. Standing your ground is important. No, do people know that there's something, there's a, there's one thing that they cannot get over on you. Like you're, you are so resolute on this one thing. And when we ha are standing our ground, our kids appreciate that. Our kids need to know that you're not getting away with this crap. Like they need to know that there's boundaries and that creates a sense of responsibility in them. And we need our kids to be responsible. There are so many things that are going on with children today because things have just gotten watered down and we're not standing for the things that we believe in. At a, as, a citizen, as citizens of the United States, certain things that are really, really important that we've always stood for in this country, I think are getting watered down. It's really important that we stand our ground on certain issues, no matter what, you don't change your mind on this. And I want to leave you with a, a verse in the Bible, and I believe it's in James, and it says that a double-minded man is unstable in all his ways, being tossed to and from to and from by the waves of the ocean. And what this means to be double-minded is to say one thing and then do another, or to do something and then say another. And are you double-minded? It's, it's really important that we be resolute and one-minded. And especially if you're in a relationship, does your spouse know that no matter what, this is your ground and we're on this. And when we say we're going to do this, we're going to do it together. And then halfway through, you change your mind. Being standing your ground and being one minded is so critical. It helps those around us trust us. So if this conversation has interested you, we're on 10 ways to inspire others. Check back in with the channel tomorrow. Cindy Berkland here. I just wanted to say thank you for watching the channel. And if you want more content, just need you to click right here. And don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel, clicking right here. If any of these conversations have interested you, please get a hold of us at cindyberkland.com or you can reach me at cindyberkland at gmail.com. Thanks again for watching.